Indiana State Police want you to know about their plans for keeping the roads safe this holiday weekend, and they want you to be on the lookout for troopers in vehicles you wouldn't normally expect to see them driving. RTV6 reporter Norman Cox fills us in on their plans. The Indiana State Police are beefing up their force for this holiday weekend. This is one of the trucks that you may see if you're rolling through a construction zone. Troopers are looking for speeders, tailgaters, and of course, people who drink and drive this weekend. And they'll be concentrating on construction zones. Even though contractors generally pull back their crews on summer holidays, that's not always true. And even when they're gone, lanes that are narrower than normal can be particularly hazardous. So they're using these plain white pickup trucks designed to look like ordinary work vehicles. Ordinary, that is, until the red and blue lights come on. This is a very common uh, truck that you would see on the highway, and a lot of times we catch people traveling as they would if they did not see a police officer around. Obviously, when you see a marked car in a construction zone, you're going to slow your speed, but uh, you don't act the way that you would possibly without that marked car in the construction zone. And state police say these trucks often go unnoticed. One trooper on his way to the news conference reported being passed by a vehicle going 88 miles an hour in a 55 zone. Troopers will be checking both your speed and how closely you're following the vehicle ahead of you with LIDAR, which is similar to radar, but uses a laser to determine the distance between two vehicles. We can set this to clock the first vehicle on coming at us and then slide off the front vehicle into the second vehicle. It will tell us how close the second vehicle was to the first vehicle so we can get a following too close distance as well as the speed. State police say they're not out to maximize ticket riding, it's just to keep you safe, but if you insist on driving too fast or too closely through a construction zone, whoever's driving this truck will be glad to write you a ticket. On the east side, I'm Norman Cox, RTV6. Now, in addition to speeding, tailgating, and drinking, police will be going after aggressive drivers, people changing lanes unsafely, and those who fail to buckle up themselves or their children.